Welcome back, everyone, and I'm here again with SBR contributor Jordan Sharp. And today we're going to be looking at how those odds have been acting up for that game between the Arizona Cardinals and the Dallas Cowboys. How you doing today, Jordan? Doing good, Dax. Thanks, man. All right, my man. So Arizona got a win last week against the Eagles to put them at 6-1 and one for the season. The deal is that they are 25th and 24th offensively and defensively, respectively. Now, as for the Cowboys, they're 6-2 and two after la last week's loss against the Redskins, which, I would have actually won if, uh, which they would have actually won if Whedon would have stayed in the game. Anyways, with Romo going down and being pulled from that game, bookies have held back on posting a line. For the time being right now, the only book that has an available line is Bet Online, and they have the Cowboys at minus four. And it looks like Romo will be a game-time decision uh, factor here, which could sway the lines if he doesn't play. But what's your take on this one, my man? Yeah, I mean, all eyes on Tony Romo right now in Dallas. Uh, ESPN's Todd Archer just recently reported about 15 minutes ago, actually, that uh, Tony Romo missed practice again today on a Thursday. So we'll see what he can do, maybe, if anything, tomorrow. But that's going to be where we're going to see uh, this this line start to come up at more books other than what it's at right now at Bet Online and sports, book, uh, sports betting, a few others. But, um, yeah, the, the, the line in this one is really going to be determined on whether or not Tony Romo plays. If he doesn't play, obviously, I think it's going to spike up to at least seven points uh, or at least at least five or six points, you know, the other direction, if not if not more than that. Um, but if he is able to play, um, you have to think that I think you'll still see at least some people, you know, throwing money in on Arizona. But right now, you know, because there's no there's not a lot of lines, we don't have a whole lot of information about this yet. So really, it's just uh, if you're really if you really think you have a play on this game and you're just waiting for the news on Tony Romo, make sure you have your eyes glued to Twitter or whatever uh, tomorrow afternoon, you know, mid afternoon after the time, you know, normally they finish practices to see if anything he what he, he was able to do during practice. And um, if, if you can get some information off of that, then you might be able to see the get the line at where it is right now before it starts to move. So really, it really all eyes on tomorrow right now for this this Cowboys uh, uh, Arizona game. Yeah, I agree, man. I mean, even though I do think that there is a little bit of value right now with Arizona at plus four, just because of the fact that they have a little bit better game going on at the moment. Um, but even though with Romo coming back, it still might be a, an iffy situation because they're, they're definitely going to shoot him up with painkillers. Uh, he's going to be lingering with that back issue. And I definitely believe that he's going to struggle trying to get the ball passed because he's going to be scared, you know, of getting hit again. Yeah, I wouldn't mind. Uh, I wouldn't mind an Arizona plus four bet right now just off speculation. Um, either way, you know, even if you wanted to do like a very small money line bet on Arizona at the current lines, because imagine this, you know, let's just say tomorrow he doesn't practice hasn't practiced all week, likelihood of playing in the game, probably not good. You get Arizona on the money line, he ends up sitting out, and you have an excellent value, you know, whereas if, if Tony Romo sits out, I think this, this line would sway easily into the favor of Arizona, where the Cowboys would, would certainly become home dogs if indeed he sat out. But obviously we don't know much yet. He could easily put in a limited practice tomorrow and be fine. So, you know, we, we just don't know. So you really can't speak on it as much as you'd like to. Yeah, definitely, Jordan. I agree with you on this one, my man. All right, as always, it's a pleasure talking football with you, and I look forward to doing this again very soon, man. All right, thanks, Dax. No problem. And for SBR Picks, this is Dax Floyd. The SBR Network offers free sports picks and game breakdowns. Big money free betting contests year-round, a real-time Vegas-style odds monitoring service, and much more. So come see for yourself. To stay updated on SBR news and promotions, follow us on Twitter, Facebook and Google+. And do be sure to subscribe to the Sportsbook Review YouTube channel to catch all our daily sports shows.